FNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from a very somber Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update and currently have a slightly mixed back out there. That mix really coming from the semis, which are basically flat. They're down 91 cents. Otherwise, all the other U.S. indices trading to the upside. You've got the Dow up 337, a little over 1 percent, eight tenths for the S&P or 31 points, flat for the NASDAQ 100. The Russell's up 32 points. That's nearly a 2 percent move out there. Gold's trading up a buck. Silver, six pennies. Like to be crude is off 62 cents. Natural gas down four cents. The 30-year Treasury trading out at 132.03. Let's try to figure out what all that means by taking a look at that nine panel market update chart. We begin in the upper left hand corner with the ES mini. What do we know about the ES mini? It has a completed buy the D point pattern, which turned into a Gartley buy pattern. We have price that is consolidating with inside its daily profile. We know where support is at. We see it with regard to those profiles. We see it with regard to the price action. The same is true with resistance. Support 3867.28, resistance 4007. Spot volatility still above its 50 day exponential moving average. So that really gives an edge to sellers, not buyers. If we take a look at the NQ, it closed above the top of its daily profile on Thursday. It did again on Friday. It is trading above it on um uh, today, this morning, what it's also doing is trading into its swing point. This is a swing point that uh, it was hit with volume. Uh, this is uh, the swing point from uh, February the 2nd. So odds favor that what the NQ wants to do, especially if price remains above 12,632, is make a move to 12,335. We take a look at the U.S. dollar index is pulling back. It's really been trading somewhat of a little bit of a sideways consolidation, but I would say a close today below. 10307 or 10302 that would trigger an A to B equals CD to the downside pattern. If we take a look at Goldilocks, gold here tried to close above the top of its uh, profile in February the uh, 2nd. That's out at the 1975.20 level. That is resistance, but closing above that is going to trigger a large A to B equals CD to the upside. Silver trading above profile levels. Uh, nothing here to suggest that it does not want to move higher. And with regard to light speed crude, I believe today will complete or form a TD9 bottom, maybe Monday, tomorrow or Tuesday, it uh, completes the pattern. We'll have to go look at that during the uh, Trader's Edge Show. But the point is that Lights We Crude is nearing a bottom signal, as well as that A to B equals CD pattern. You'd love to see a bullish reversal candle to confirm a buy the D point. 30-year uh, Treasury right now, it's got a new profile it's attempting to form. Resistance at 133.29, support at 128.10. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Edge Show. If you have to start through Monday, please have a magnificent one. And we'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.